what are you guys out here doing? What toy, honey? Your Spider-Man toy? What about y'all check the backyard? Is it is it leaves in the gutter? No. Oh, it's empty? You hear me? You playing outside? So I started hiding presents, so I just get these 30 gallon trash bags and I just um, keep the stuff hidden in these bags um, and keep them in like bins like this and uh, that way the kids can't find them. Dan, yeah. you got ready? Okay, yeah. hey, come on. Dan's going to a sleepover, so we're going to drop him off. We're going to go to Sean's game, pick Sean up, and then go um drop daniel off at his friend's house for a sleepover all right so we are gonna head oh that is too close all right so we are gonna head out and go and take care of dropping him off and then go and get sean ready so we're headed to um the game and yeah it's pretty much what we've been doing much of nothing um, Jimmy went into work. I have been sorting through my clothes and my room and getting everything organized. Um, yeah, so it's just been really a, a cleaning Saturday and um, got a couple sports. We got a, uh, Sean has an eye appointment because he can't see in one of his classes. So I've got to take him over there. And then we're finally going to go get that camera because remember we bought one. It was crazy. So we took that one back. So we've got more time today to go and look for the one that we want um, if they have it in stock. So we're going to try to go and uh, look for that today. My people. Hope you guys had a great work week. Or Lacey fam. Yeah, the Lacey fam. Can I call them that? Can I call you guys that? The Lacey fam? You guys are family now. What's going on? How you doing? Hope you guys had a great week. Today's just another relaxing day. The weekend is here, people. It's time to be in a great mood and great cheer. Go pick up Sean and go do what we do. All right, so guys, like family drama yesterday, right? With the uh, Shawnee Boy baseball game. And um, we were sitting there watching the whole game. Sean just did not get in the game. And usually coach puts him in. To do what Sean do, and he was putting in other kids that wasn't as good as Sean. So we was wondering what was going on. After the game, we said, "Sean, you know, coach ain't play you. What happened?" And Sean said he was ineligible. <laughs> what you mean he was ineligible? Like, oh yeah, uh, uh, I didn't get good grades. Like Sean, what do you mean you didn't get grades? Yeah, remember, Mom, I showed you. My um, one of my uh, homework, homework assignments, assignments that I didn't pass. I said, Sean, but you was getting an A in the classroom if you missed one, if you failed one homework assignment, that doesn't make you ineligible. He said, Oh, well, I told Coach. He said, I want to be the big the the what do you say? I wanted to be the better person. <laughs> he wanted to be the better person and not keep. And a he secret. went up there and told Coach that he was ineligible. The teacher didn't say he was ineligible. No one said he was an eligible. Because the, the teachers, every week, they uh, any, any of the athletes, they just report back to the coaches um, who's ineligible and who's not, or whatever. You know, they, they let them know. So he went up Sean to the coach. Sean just assumed since he had a bad grade. <laughs> yeah, so he went up in the coach and told coach he couldn't play because he was ineligible. So he didn't play. He didn't. So right now we had his baseball game. And it was game. cold yesterday, and we sat in that cold all day. And he's day. still sitting on the bench again today. So I think he told Coach that he was eligible. He made a mistake, so he probably be playing today. And then uh, we got an email from Coach saying that you know today is pitcher day, wear your black jersey. And guess what? Sean didn't have a black jersey because he switched numbers with one of the kids. One of the varsity boys was whining for the past four weeks yeah. because Sean had number 12 and he really wanted number 12. 
So Sean being just who Sean is, he decided to go ahead and give the boy number 12 because that was the boy's number last year. Yep, so, so. Sean, Sean says, you know what? Since you really want this number, you had it since you was... In sixth grade, I think. A baby, you know what? A baby. Uh, I'm going to be a good teammate and let you have it. But the boy forgot to switch out, give Sean his jersey. So we got to the game. Sean ain't had the right jersey to take pictures. So he was not in the team photo. So it's been some trouble. Um, I paid for pictures already. There's nothing I can do about it. And if they took individual photos today... And he wouldn't have gotten any. So I just paid for photos for no reason. Now, I did after, you know, after work, you know me, you know fathers, and my brain, I did say, you know what, I'm going up there and I'm about to regulate. That's what I'm about to do. I'm going to go do. I'm going to tell the kids, parents, like, hey, you know what, my son did your son a favor. Is there any way someone can go home and get the jersey? Do what a father would do. So I get up here. And Sean had on his jersey. The kid did call his mom and tell her to bring up the jersey. So he he must have just, just forgot and he apologized to Sean. So that was good. But um, picture time is over yeah. and he's still not on the roster because I think they made the roster for the game today, yesterday. Yep. And knowing is, uh, that, that Sean, he, they thought Sean was ineligible. Yeah. So that's the drama of our lives, people. That that is a drama of our lives. So he's been here since nine. It's one thirty or so. So he's just been sitting there because they have to stay at the game, um, even if they're not playing. You have to be here. So he just been sitting for four or five hours, however long. But I do want to say this: Dad is proud of my baby boy. You know, he he thought he wanted to be the bigger person and let coach know that he was ineligible. He wanted to be a good teammate and give his teammates. So that that shows that shows dad that my son is thinking of others. So dad is proud of him for yeah. doing that. He gonna make his little mistakes, and I'm pretty and sixth sure. Sixth grade has been hard already. I mean, honestly, we've been up like we've been ending the vlogs like at six thirty or seven o'clock, and me and Sean has been up late. Or we it won't, when they have games usually after school. We don't even get home till 8.30. Yeah. And then from 8.30 to like 10.30, me and Sean are doing homework because he has homework like in every class. Yes. So he's just struggling with balancing, jumping right into middle school, then having all like seven classes with homework, plus a demanding sports schedule. Yeah, but he, he's, you know what, Sean is smart, so he um he's trying, he likes to be, he a perfectionist when it comes he to is. his work. He is, oh my gosh. He want to make sure When it comes sure to he, anything, he has to have things in order, or he has, he does, you know, he has panic attacks and has to use his inhaler. I'm, I'm glad that Sean is smart because, man, that, that the sixth grade homework, that homework, I have right. no clue how to do. Yeah. Like, look, I haven't done that in who knows how many years. So I'm like, Dad, I need help with this problem. I look at him like, oh, man, son, we got to go to the Internet for that one. Yeah, he's Let's been having a lot of tests he's been yeah. having to study for. I've been doing some of his reading for him, like reading his reading book aloud because um, he just is his brain is mentally exhausted. So I've been we've been sitting in my bed doing some reading because he's got to get a book read before the 26th so he has to read the book do a project on it and turn it in on the 26th and that's every month you pick a new novel or you pick a new book and you do a assignment for it every week I mean every month so yeah that's the um so just to let you guys know how your family is doing that's, <laughs> right this is your family too as well that's how your shiny poo doing and that's how your <laughs> shine is doing um uh, but like I said, guys, thanks for subscribing. You know, thanks for sharing and all the comments and stuff. We do appreciate it. Yeah. We won. You won? Yeah, by one point. So I see you had the jersey. Uh-huh. Were well, you able to be in the team picture? Yep. She brought it in time? Yeah. How um, close was it? Huh? How close was it when she brought it? Oh, uh, probably like five minutes. Oh, like as soon as it. you said something to him, he called her? Yeah. My was okay. And she turned back around and brought it. Uh -huh. Did you get to play? Yeah, I did. I got to play right, I mean, center. You so did? That's good. Yeah, All I right. told Coach. 
Oh, you tell coach that you made, a, you made an accident? Yeah, he just wrote me down. I didn't have to explain anything. I just said uh, that was, I was wrong. Oh, okay. Good. That's good. Good, yeah. All right, let's go. All right, so we just left the um, eye exam, and Sean got some glasses. We'll get them back at the end of the week. Um, I couldn't film because I lost the camera in the car. And then we, we're at Best Buy, so Jimmy wants to do a Best Buy haul. All right, all right what up, guys? About to do a man haul right here from Best Buy. When you go to Manly stores, a man should do the haul. My wife does the grocery hauls and all the other hauls. Well, it's my turn to do a haul, okay? So first up from Best Buy, bam, most wanted. For the kids, they about to get it in. Gaming. This is 1999 Xbox 360 game. Can't beat it. All right, let's go to the next one. Uh-oh. Dan the man, <laughs> superhero game, he gonna love it. This was 34 bucks right here. Great deal. I thought it was 29.99. Oh yeah, 29. Oh, I'm... this is my first haul, people. <laughs> Have mercy. Have mercy. <laughs> All your superheroes on there, and then bam, and bam. Look at that right Yay. there. Look at that. Sing hallelujah to the Lord. We got a new camera. All right, guys, we got a new We're Canon official vloggers again. Power shot. We're back in action. And let me show you something, too, as well. Uh, how much did we pay for all this? That's when you're supposed to break it down, right, honey? All right, let me break it down. On this haul, we paid $2.27 for all of this stuff. Two dollars and twenty-seven cents for the camera and, and two usual. games. I know you guys are thinking, like, "Oh my gosh, how did you guys get that? What coupons did you get? Where did you go to get it?" Well, I'm not telling you. You don't put to tell the people in the hall, right? Are you supposed to tell them how you did it? Well, I'm not telling how you did it. See, man, we keep you, you, you can't. We we don't expose all the secrets to the halls, to the man halls. I just want to let you guys know that the deals are out there, okay? And that's it. You know, so run the Best Buy. <laughs> you know, run, people. Run the Best Buy. $2.27 for all of this, guys. Well, until next time, thanks for checking out. I'm just playing about $2.27, but still, though, I know I got your hopes up, did I? Sorry about that. Until next time, peace. Here you go, the, uh, which one we decided to get. The PowerShot Elf 340 HS. The one we had before was the PowerShot Elf 110 HS that was our original and then you know we bought the power shot f 150 but it was IS and the IS uh, are not good they were not good so gotta go with the HS that's the best brand um, with the Canon so all right we we gonna head to storage y'all thought she was all organized y'all be like oh Marcia you're so organized and you know, you're you're great, but the truth is, this is the truth. I'm finna show you guys the truth. Oh this is God. the truth. This is terrible. Honey, why she a hoarder. This? She a hoarder, people. Stop. She's a hoarder. Oh, a gap size 14. I wish I could fit in those. A hoarder. How do we do this, honey? I don't know why we did this. I mean, how, how are we supposed to get this stuff out I of here? I think what happened was... Honey, that's fall decor way back there. I had, uh, we came over here one day looking for something, and it was Stop. cold or whatever. Yes. We so we threw, threw everything here. back up in here, and this is the consequence of it. This is... Oh, my gosh. Our I sin mean, has been revealed. Right. I don't want to have to deal with that. Yeah, we got a nice, like, $400 piano thingy in here. Because Nene wanted to take piano one year yep. when she was homeschooled. And she did it for like four months. And, and she quit. <laughs> so, this is it, people. And this is the thing. She actually wanted us to buy like a $3,000 piano. And I was, Manny, I want to take beats. those for my couponing stuff. Sick These gray bins. This is our storage. We got to organize it. I'm oh, not about to do it Let's today. See. Uh oh. All right. We probably better. People take of Bikini Bottom. Oh this yeah, here is... we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, jujitsu. Honey, your gi in here. Oh, bring the gi on out of there, man. You got some work turtlenecks in oh, there. Oh, there we go. Yeah, bring that basket right there, because I'm getting back into my martial art people. 
here. It's too heavy. I need to fold somebody up. I've been wanting. Well, actually, it's been a while, so I'm gonna get folded up. But it's okay though. Don't worry about that because so my skill gonna, is gonna come back. Are we gonna soon. just come back for Christmas? Yeah, we'll just come back. Okay. All right, let me help the wife out. We could just take it and then put it in the garage. Where the Christmas stuff at? It's labeled Christmas, and there's clothes in there. Let's see that. Chew. I'm pretty sure I was stressed out when I did this. <laughs> Oh my goodness. That was my fault. Yes. My now we fault. now people we did not check this before we opened it up. It could have been somebody living up in here, but Oh, they can't fit in here. You never know, man. You never know who's back there. Yeah. Well, let me help her out. See you guys in a bit. One thing you guys need to know about this storage. This is actually um must confess like I told you you guys are family so we we keeping everything real. Um, when my wife put me out the house and like like kicks me out, this is where I come to stay. Let me give you a MTV tour, show you what what goes on here. All right, so I usually move out this stuff. This is sleeping area right here. This is where I sleep at. Um, over in the corner right it? here, I, I have my food. Uh, the refrigerator was up in here, but I think we took it back out. Mm -hmm. I'm out the doghouse, so I get to come back. Um, when I get bored, I get on the keyboard, play some 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 soulful, lonely boys and men. Sometimes Brian Night music right here. As you see, the luggage right there. This is where I. This is some closet? of my clothes. Yeah, my closet. You can say that too as well. Um, over back over in this corner right here, you can see the fishing pole. There's a lake about a mile away. I go fish, hunt. I do it all. Um, but yeah, tackle box, humidifier. fire. See it, people? This is um, this is where I stay at. This is um, life for me when I'm when I'm in the doghouse. This is where I go. Uh, wife kicks me out. This is where I come. Right here. You know, I don't believe she should do this, but. What I'm supposed to do, you know. This is how she treats me. I told you, baby, I was gonna tell the people about this, but she didn't believe me. But you know, honesty is the key, people. Okay. <laughs> but y'all blame her. This is where I be at, man. This is my humble abode. Whenever she kicks me out the house, so at just want you. Warm. At least you got. Yeah, I, I don't complain, baby. I'm door. grateful. I mean, I'm grateful. Sean, um, put the tackle box back. I don't I complain. Not fishing. It's got our fishing stuff. That's my fishing stuff for when I'm hungry and stuff. Stuff. Gotta put that butt back, buddy. Put it back, buddy. Put it back. But yep, that's it, guys. Just want to let you guys feel you guys up in that another part of our life. This is where she 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 holds me at. Stop. You know <laughs> Come on, Sean. How was it? <laughs> we still got our baby in his baseball uniform. That's how long we've been gone. Your door open over there, but oh. All right. We're going to run to CVS because I got to get my little $4 ECB for uh, Maybelline. It said I had $2 to spend before they gave me back a $4 extra care buck. So I'm going to go and give me some type of Maybelline uh, product. Huh? Yeah, CVS. Taking some more Maybelline? Yeah. I don't get it. Baby, why you keep getting all this makeup when you clearly don't need it? You're already too beautiful. I mean, you don't, you don't, honey. You're gorgeous. I don't, I don't know what to tell people. You can tell them bye. People! <laughs> people! I'm about to go home and play some video games. You think? I'm playing all of them first. Man, Sean about to rock some video games. Put your belt on, sweetheart. See? We just left out of County Market and got four 12-packs of soda for $5. Um, I forgot that I had $2.50 off any two um, County Market brand soda. So, um, we ended up getting them for $1.13 for a 12-pack of soda. So, that's going to last us for many family nights. Um, so that we don't have to buy drinks. So we went ahead and did that. The, it, the coupon expired today, so I had to use it or lose it. So we are finally heading home at five o'clock. 
been gone since the crack of dawn. Um, so we're finally going to head home. Sean's going to play on the game. Honey, what are you doing when we get home? You were hooking up your game or something? Might. Where are your cords at? Yeah. I know where they are. I still got to work on my closet, so I'm just going to go work in my room. I might watch and, the show or something like that. Well, yeah, you watch TV. And then I'm going to just work in my room because... Uh, yeah, he wants to go on a date today, but I don't really want to. I, I want to kind of get some... That's your own fault. I need some quality time. No, because I got to try to get quality up. Quality time. Who's messing with a man's quality time? You hear me, girl? Tell the people. I don't feel like getting dressed, hair. I Tell just them. don't want to. Tell them. People. Family. Get Honey, on her. You shouldn't have you shouldn't have made me get on her. You shouldn't have made me run around all day today. You should have said, babe, take the day off. Relax at home. Get your stuff done. Then you could get dressed up. Get all your hair done. You have plenty of time. While I rip and run and do all, go to Best Buy by yourself, take Sean to the appointment by yourself, go to storage by yourself, pick up Sean by yourself, drop off Daniel by yourself. Then I could go on a date. I'm tired. Honey, this was none of my idea to do all this ripping and running. Yeah, it should have been your idea if you plan on going on a date. Look, don't mess with my quality time, okay? We going out. We're going to take a rain check. There ain't no such thing as a rain check in this household. I got to put my foot down. Look at all them storage bins I got to go through this Don't week. change the subject. <laughs> I got to put my... You know what? Skip it. You, see my, ba down. you see my baby in the, the back. The foot is down, people. Be a good example for that baby in the back. Sean, put the foot down. <laughs> the foot is down. It's, it's oh, done. man. Cut I the can't stand It's done. We going out. Going out here in a couple hours. I bet we finna be saying thank you guys for watching our vlog, and we'll see you guys the next one. They ain't gonna see no date. You know I that guarantee. Storage? That's gonna be your new home. The storage ain't gonna be my new home. That's gonna be your new home. Did you home. just do a tap and roll? A tap and roll. Yes. Yeah. You didn't come to a complete stop. Don't try to change the subject. <laughs> That's what you're trying to do, but Come on, man. Don't mess with a man's quality time. Quality time. And. The memory card is full. We are filming with the new camera. Let's go spy on the girls. Oh, ladies. Uh, no. What are you girls doing She's out here? Back. No. Nails. No. Singing and dancing. Go. Oh, look Kitty. at that vibrant Go. camera. Never bothered me anyway. There you guys go.